Lorraine Kelly, 61, spoke candidly about the moment her husband told her to seek medical help after noticing a change in the ITV star. The TV presenter has been vocal about her past struggles when it came to the menopause. Speaking to Express.co.uk, she admitted it was not her, but her husband who noted her behavior had been different. She called on other women to start conversations around the menopause to raise awareness of the symptoms. The TV star also mentioned Always Discreet's initiative to help women understand what happens during that period of their lives. She said, everybody's menopause is different, everybody's symptoms are different, but it's about getting as much information as you can. The amazing thing that Always Discreet is doing, is you can actually log on, to their website, and go to the website to get as much information as you can. And then you can make the choices about your menopause, about how to deal with your menopause in the right way. And when you go to your GP and you know, don't be fobbed off, and just say, I need help. She explained how when she had her menopause, her husband noticed she had been feeling anxious. However, she initially believed it was the demands of her high-profile job. She explained, I mean, it was basically my husband who said to me what I was going through. He said, you need to get help, you need to go see the doctor because you're not yourself. You're used to getting too anxious, in pain, you're tired. And I just thought all of that was just the demands of the job. I got up very early, but I was always able to cope with all of that. I was sort of thriving on stress and the buzz of telly. And I couldn't understand why all of a sudden I was feeling so tired. And again, it's like what we are seeing with so many women feeling underprepared. It creeps up on you. It takes you by surprise and it shouldn't. Lorraine explained that as a society, everyone should try and get those conversations going and redefine what it's all about. The TV star also urged women to avoid feeling embarrassed by the menopause. She continued, and dragging menopause into the light so that everybody can just think it's just part of life. Let's not be silly about it, let's not be embarrassed.